Hello folks, Steve Manley, team leader of the MySearchForHomes.com team at Exit Realty. And you can always reach me at 931-215-8987. Folks, today I'm coming to you from 3807 Cecil Farm Road in Mount Pleasant, Tennessee. Folks, what a beautiful home this is, a one owner home. Was originally built in uh, 2004, features some great updates as well. Uh, the home features three bedrooms, two and a half baths, has a two car garage, sits on 19.67 of beautiful Maury County acres. Uh, it has a uh, four stall barn. It has a two car carport out near the barn. We have water down there. We're gonna go over there and take a look at here that in just a few minutes. Uh, but folks, this is a beautiful home. Beautiful wraparound porch, beautiful hardwoods, all new carpets. Just a beautiful, beautiful home. I'm gonna step out of the way. We could take just a little bit better look. It's a 30-year architectural roof up on top there. Uh, folks, I'm going to pan around here just a little bit where you can take in some of this beautiful scenery out here before we go inside and walk around. Uh, currently, this home is in the Hampshire uh, School District. That's K-12. through A lot of, a lot of uh, people have said so many great things about the school system here. And taxes, uh, taxes on all of this property, $1,801.02 a year. All right, I'm going to take us a, a little tour outside before we go in, and uh, let's get going. All right, I wanted to pan just uh, a little bit around out here in the front before we walk inside uh, here at 3807 Cecil Farm Road. But there is our arena. We also have a training arena here. You can see that in the distance. We have a barn down in the hollow over there. Uh, we have fencing and cross fencing. We've got some extra parking out here. And what a view. What a view it is out here. Uh, got a driveway, uh, not too long off the road. It's very quiet, peaceful out here. Uh, we are located just a short drive uh, to the main road that takes us into town and towards Franklin, Interstate 65. Uh, so a great location. We'll pan around, we can take in just a little bit of this. really really nice all right let's go inside and take a walk around folks right before we go inside here I wanted to just pan around from the porch got a really nice wraparound porch here on the front and uh, that actually leads into our kitchen area there there's our barn beautiful hillside country out here really really nice all right all right folks now I am inside here at 3807 Cecil Farm Road in Mount Pleasant again very close to Hampshire and what a beautiful kitchen we have folks I mentioned this is a one owner home here's our pantry right here we've got lots and lots of cabinet space countertop space in this kitchen and it is a very large kitchen we've got tile on the floor uh, the paint is like new throughout this house large large eating area uh, beautiful plantation shutters that'll be staying on the windows just really really nice space we've got an open area out here on the porch and in between two open areas on the porch, we've got a screened in porch. So we've got a view of that right there. We've got an entrance to that screened in porch right from the living room there. And looking back, remember a few moments ago, I was out on the front porch looking around. Well, here is a pedestrian door out onto that front porch right here from the kitchen area. And as we step from the kitchen area uh, out towards the front of the house, uh, Beautiful oak hardwood floors in here that have been uh, up. This has been update a uh, new feature as well. Looking out at the beautiful landscape out here. Beautiful area this is. Nice formal dining room. There's our front door. We've got a nice uh, formal foyer right here. Again, new hardwoods. Really, really nice. As you come in from the front door, we've got two closets on either side here our dining room on the left and as we walk in we have our beautiful living room area right here what a gorgeous room this is plenty of space 
no space wasted in this house, vaulted ceilings, got a stone fireplace uh, here, uh, which burned by propane, propane gas. There is our screened in area of the porch. And what a great area this is. I'm gonna open this door just briefly where we can look. Really, really nice. And again, this opens up to our open area of the porch that's not screened on that side. And a, a very large open area on this side that comes right off the master bedroom area there. All right. And as we walk back inside, right off of the living room area here, we go down and here is our stairs going upstairs, our master bedroom. So the master is on the main level and we have a half bath. And this also leads to that open porch we were just looking at. So you come in from the porch, you can come right into the half bath area here. Got a beautiful pedestal sink, tile flooring. Again, the paint in this house. The house is in just fantastic shape. Beautiful hardwoods in here. And our master, again, beautiful, beautiful deck out here. Porch covered. What a great place to wake up each morning. This is a large room. You can, uh, it's a, it has a nice walk, nice size walk-in closet right here. And peering into the master suite quickly, we have tile flooring, double bowl vanities, whirlpool tub, and that's a deep one, nice size, nice and big. Stand-up shower, and our commode room area. And as we come up out of the master bedroom here on the first floor, and we come back out into the living room area here. As we come down this end of the hallway, we have our laundry room area. Let me open this door. Very nice uh, room. We've got a drop down ironing board right there. We've got shelving right here. Uh, pedestal sink right here, washer and dryer. And on this side, this opens to our two car garage, oversized two car garage. And on this side is our steps going downstairs. We're gonna go down there last in the house. Let's go upstairs. Okay, I've made my way to the top of the stairs here. All new carpeting on the stairs up here as well. And when you get to the top of the stairway, there is a nice hallway here and it is outfitted. Uh, this would make a great work area for the kids, uh, hobby area, uh, office area. Really, really nice. Got plenty of built-in cabinets here. It's a little closet here at the top of the stairs. At the top of the stairs, down the hallway, on the to the right, is a large bedroom really nice this is overlooking the back um, side of the property we've got a nice walk-in closet here and then uh, an additional storage out there and mechanicals out there as well the um, again this house is like new in so many ways it's had some nice updates um, everything appears to be in great shape. Um, has split unit. One of them is just three years old for the upper level. And as we come and take a left at the top of the stairs, we've got a large full bath here with a combination stand-up shower tub. Tile on the floor. Nice sink. And just behind and across from the bathroom behind me here is, these are new Pergo floors in here. Uh, a bonus room and a nice bonus room at that. Great space again, nice hobby room area, game room, could be used for a lot of different uh, uses. And at the end of the hall, here is bedroom three. Again, another nice size room. And this room also has a nice 
walk-in closet. All right. Let's go down into the basement area. All right, I've made my way to the lower level, the basement level of the home. And when you get down to the lower level, you can see we've got... Now these two rooms are not included in the square footage that we talked about, the 2856. However, there is ductwork down here uh, to provide heating and cooling. So uh, it could be included in the uh, space. Um, it's a pretty large room down here. Um, really, really nice. Got the drop ceilings. It has another room. This is a uh, an exterior door here. Another room comes right in. We've got two doors going out to the outside, out towards the barn down there. Again, another large room right here. So again, that far wall over there by that light switch is the stairs coming down got two big rooms right here this one that we just in this one and then just off of this room uh, is another room that make a great storm shelter area uh, uh, workstation workshop again uh, there's not a vent in here um, but I suppose one could put one in here but there's not a vent in here but again a great space um, it's very comfortable down here right now and the temperature outside this morning is probably about 45 degrees so um, it was cold overnight, but you wouldn't know it in here. All right. Now, that's uh, finished with the tour of this beautiful home. Let's go outside and finish up. I just wanted to stop here over near the arena and take a quick glance at that so we could get a quick look. Nice fenced-in arena. Great for training. There's our fencing, our gates to the uh, get in. And just to give you a reference as you... You can see we get some fencing over here. There's the house up there. Uh, we do have a two vehicle carport out here. There's a horse trailer currently underneath it. And we are about to go back to the barn back there. And there is a little creek down here. So there's water out here. And there is uh, water at the barn as well. All right, let's go over to the barn and take a quick, quick peek. All right, folks, I've made my way down to the barn here. And looking back up at the house to give you a reference of where I'm at. Again, we've got some fencing here. Really nice barn. Uh, we've got some covered storage area right here on the side. We've got water right here. I do see elect uh, electric out here. A nice uh, tin roof, metal roof up there. This is a full stall barn. And we have a tack room, covered porch area right here. And as I step down, there's our one stall there. So we've got two handles there. There's our two stalls, one, two. And then we've got one down here on the end. That's three. And the one opposite side, four. And again, as we step back through, plenty of space. Uh, to work here. Again, covered porch area right here. And then here's our tack room. And it has a loft as well. Really, really nice. So folks, this property does have it all. It's got it all. All right. I wanted to, right before we sign off here, just take a peek around here at the back of the house. Uh, there is our uh, open uh, deck area right here. It's covered open. There's our screened in porch that we looked at a few minutes ago and on the other end, uh, the other end of the open porch. So uh, this comes right off the master. Just a beautiful, beautiful um, area. What a great place to call home. And this is what every morning could be like for you. All right, let's finish up. Folks, I want to thank you for taking a few minutes out of your busy day to visit with me here today at 3807 Cecil Farm Road in Mount Pleasant, Tennessee. Folks, this is very close to Hampshire. Beautiful area out here. Folks, this home has a great price on it. It won't last long. It is a beautiful, beautiful home that uh, appears to be in fantastic condition. So again, 
Uh, my name is Steve Manley, team leader of the MySearchForHomes.com team uh, at Exit Realty. Please feel free to give me a call, 931-215-8987. Have your agent give us a call to set up your own private showing out here. Um, we look forward to your visit. Again, thanks for watching, and as always, I hope that you are able to make it a great day.